and we're back guys welcome to let's play Star Wars the Old Republic Jedi Knight playthrough Shadow of Revan part 5 chapter 5 alright so last time we left up we were just about to meet back up with some Mandalorians but before we actually all do that let's get rid of this uh, roll system which we are going to do right now by doing one simple side mission well more of a class mission to be honest but yeah At least that is when we get loaded in. Come on. There we are. Right. Now then, um... Yeah. Oh yeah, I was actually going to say this, um... I totally forgot what I was about to say, but now I remember it back again. Um, s next month, probably at the end of next month, somewhere around that, uh, I won't be recording any more episodes until my sister is actually able to walk around the, hou the house again. So yeah, because she's going to uh, get surgery. So yeah, she well, she's actually going to have surgery done on her. And I actually am going to be taking care of her for, well, whenever the hell my mom's away. And I don't think you guys all want to hear my little sister yelling my name every 10 minutes. So yeah, that's mainly why. Anyway, but before we actually go in there, we actually have one more stop to make. Actually, two more. Here we go. If you guys want to read this, just pause the vid, as always. Keep it up here for a little bit. Now I'm going to scroll down for a little bit more. There we go. Ren Maru and his crew are waiting to hear your orders. What's it gonna be, boss? Look for anyone in need, and lend them a hand. No charge. Doing good ought to help your standing with the residents around here. Check back later. Should have something for you. Yeah, I'm not gonna be rolling for this mission because uh, a crew of your own basically... I mean... To be honest, I can actually farm XP this way. I think you can actually gain XP. Yep, there we go. 162 experience points. Alright. Yep. Anyway, let's follow our feelings. The scars we bear. And here we are. I grew up here, you know. And I mean here. This house. Not just Rishi. Of course, I was young when the Jedi found me. Don't remember much more than the walls, a, a blanket and a few friendly faces. Master Orgas. But it seemed as good a place as any to visit one last time. Hello, Padawan. Got time for a final lesson from an old friend? It's good to see you, Master. Any lesson you have to share, you know I'll listen. Whether you'll act on it is something else, hmm? It's good to see you, too. Since you set out to defeat the Emperor, you've been fighting almost non-stop. You've been waist-deep in dirt and fear and blood. Since the Emperor's fall, the war has only gotten uglier. And there are dark times coming for the galaxy and for you. You've sensed what's to come? Just a little. And I'm worried you'll forget why you're fighting. Defending the Republic, vanquishing the Sith, those are tools a Jedi uses in the service of life, of people, not ends unto themselves. Every day I face pain. I inflict suffering out of necessity on those we call the enemy. It eats at you. 
That's the nature of war. I went through it too. I want to help you reconnect. We're going to take a little time, help the people of Rishi. Folks eking out a living good and bad, living in fear of guns and pirates. You're going to make their lives better, as only you can. You're going to feel why you're a Jedi. I can think of no better way to spend my time here. Where do we begin? There are a lot of people without homes on Rishi. Those people are catching Tamaman fever. On Corellia, they'd cure it for free. Here, no one much cares. No one but you. Your doc can treat a person in minutes. You've got a ship packed with food and medicine. I understand. Yes, you do. No Sith Lords, no ancient evils this time. Just doing a bit of good. All right. There. Go good as good, nail. One. There we go. So yeah, this was Master Orcus Din's home, apparently. And now we are going to cure some victims of the Tananam of the fever, basically. Yeah, good as nail. Who are you? Why are you helping us? Not a lot of trust for strangers on Rishi. <laughs> Can you blame them? <coughs> Too weak to talk, but he'll remember this. Not only that, in a few months he'll be back on his feet. He's a gambler, a con man. But he'll do he'll what live. it takes to stop the fever on Rishi. This one won't remember you. Don't take it personal. But he will bring joy back into his wife's life. She'll be stronger for it, and she'll build a stronger community. You'll live. You've changed a lot of lives. But we're not done yet. The monsoon baffles protect the spaceport during the wet season. Or they're supposed to when they're not broke. Pirates just take shelter, but everyone else spends months wading through water, miserable and struggling. What do you suppose they'd use those months for if they weren't hurting them? You've got technical training and all the best astromechs in the galaxy. See what you can do about it. Alright, so uh, let's just keep going now to this area down here, finish the last few of the monsoons that are currently need to be repaired and then we'll probably be going wait we still actually need to do one more thing after this one but that's in the exact same area where we we are basically heading right now to so yeah now I was I was first thinking why the hell is that dude in his uh, underwear just golfing but yeah now now I actually know what, what what that place was? It was actually like a beach or something. Yeah. Not sure why you'd want to go on. God damn it! Great. I felt off from it. Here we go. Have another one. Come on. There we go. You live. 
could kill those guys, but I'd rather not kill them. There, we have another free one. There, good as new. I need to kill a few of them. Sorry, guys, but yeah, you all need to die for the cause. There, good as new. God damn, really? Uh. There we go. Let's grab the loot and repair the last one. What season's going to be better next year? Folks will work better, eat better. They'll have time to sit and talk and dream of a better future. You can do that when you're not scrambling to survive. One more job for you. You're fine. Give you a little exercise. Gang war years back left a lot of buildings in ruin. All that rubble's still there. Scrap hauler droids could do the job in hours, but scrap haulers are a luxury for these people. A Jedi with a lightsaber in the Force Thome. You could clean it up easy. Doesn't look like much, does it? But I asked you to do this for a reason. Better town, cleaner town, gives people pride, gives a sense of control. But it's also practical. Neighborhoods grow like gardens. They need space. They need to intertwine. <laughs> You're pulling weeds. How far will the good you've done go? You've changed a lot of lives here and there. Those lives will affect others. Ripples can become a tsunami. Next year will be better. But in ten years, these people will send the pirates packing. Those who don't settle down. In a century, Rishi will thrive. The locals will live in harmony with life and nature. It started today with you. They won't remember, but be proud. And there we have it. Now then, for the information why I basically did do like a little uh, randomized op choice options. You guys all will find it out right after we actually are back to Master Orgus Din's uh, home. You guys all will then find out why. Now I can of course. No, I can't do that, right? I don't really like this galaxy map travel thing. I mean... Can it easy travel like to other systems? But I don't, if I remember right, if I yeah, you still actually need to pay, and I don't actually really like that. I mean, basically took away a little bit of time traveling back to a ship. I mean, can people can't complain about that that much, right? That little walk to your ship. And besides, it actually felt like all right to do that. But yeah, anyway. And here we go. There, good as new. Master Orgus? You know, when I died, <laughs> strange to say that, it wasn't my victories that gave me comfort. It was all their faces, the people I'd helped, the people I'd served, made the pain forgettable. Suppose you last long enough to see the war end. How will you live? How will you find comfort when your time finally comes? When the war ends, I hope to be rid of my lightsaber forever. I want a quiet life. Maybe on a farm or cooking street food on Coruscant. Sometimes the Force leads us to simplicity. I hope you find what you want. What we did today, I lied a bit. It wasn't just about helping Rishi or reminding you why you fight. It was about healing an old scar you've almost forgotten. 
One that still aches inside you. The Emperor. You were under his control. His darkness soaked through to your spirit. When we freed you, you pushed the memories of his training down deep. I can bring those memories back. You're strong enough to handle them. Let the light cure them and make you whole. I stood against the Emperor on Droman Kaas. I don't fear him in my memories. Nor should you. Fear only leads to hate. Today on Rishi, you felt love. I am whole. Then it's my time to go. Thank you, Master Orgus, for all you've done for me. May it bring you peace. It already has. You won't see me again, Padawan, but you won't have to. You won't be alone in the dark days to come. The Force will be with you always. And there we have it. That's mainly why I decided to make to do that little roll thingy. Yep, and level 70 is the max. Nice. So now all that's left are these command XP thingies. Live. Hold on, uh, do I need to send these packs? Nope, they're bound, so not sure how I can... Binds to legacy, alright, so I share these over my legacy. Right. Definitely want this, because this... Yeah, you can't send them over. Alright, let me then just claim that. Let's disintegrate that to get to the next tier 2. Uh, you know what? I can actually bind on equip. Alright, yeah, that's fine. Let me just grab that. Grab you. Claim. Don't need you or you. There we go. Right. Now need to remove the green the blue one the green one I need to keep All right and let's actually go out there and sell some of this stuff because whoo we actually do have a lot of junk that we don't really need anyway time for us to get some better uh, stats These are the gloves, yep. And the shop should normally be up here somewhere. Our monster is actually a really low, alright. We actually do have a lot of endurance. So. Taken an interest in me. You vendor. Nice to see customers. Can well, I get you anything? Oh. He's just wondering what you must taste like. Oh. Oh, no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. this is actually a lot better, right? right? This too. Those are actually all upgrades, so I'm gonna keep them. You are actually an upgrade too, but I can't keep you. Need to sell you. May just keep you. Boots are worse. Worse. Uh, sell you. Keep you. Sell you. Don't need this. Don't need that. I can actually keep this. And I think that's Hold on, Outlander Pummeler two six Yeah, alright. Think Feel free to browse. That's it. Let me 
to equip all of this. Yeah, we don't really look right now all that great. Huh, they have in four pummelers or boots, or a lot better actually than the one that I have, alright. There we go. Alright! Doing the flashpoint. There, good as new. And here we go, and now I'm gonna switch Kira back up to damage because we are already going to get our tank and healer droid when we start this flashpoint, so yeah. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna be cutting this flashpoint in two parts. So you guys already all know. Approaching Torch's Island. We're reaching pretty close to the 30 minute marker already, so yeah, that's why I'm gonna be cutting it up into two parts, this flashpoint. Plus, I'm going to be bulk recording all of these episodes anyway, so yeah. Right, Torches Island. Also, I actually did mention that I was actually going to be uh, the green one. I need to remove you. I was actually going to be switching hilts again. I totally forgot to do that, so let's just do this right now. I uh, need that, and then I probably will be just rearranging real quickly like this, all of this. Um. Brand new color crystals. Let's pick a green and taking farmhand, yep, farmhand blue crit. There we go. Your power and your crit, right. There we go. And here we are. There we go. This looks nice, right? To break your record, boss. Here we go. There we go, need to get that uh, leap off cooldown, uh, back on cooldown because otherwise... Not sure, is it actually a lot longer without? Cooldown is 14.8. Yeah, no, it actually goes... Uh, Oh, oh yeah, I actually have like another point left, my last point left. Um, mm, 
Yeah, let's just go with that one. Because I really do love the uh, for the uh, force camouflage or yeah, force camouflage ability. I really do love it. Stay out of that AoE. Right. Let's get in here. Yeah, I have to say, I actually do like the this color for uh, this lightsaber. The green one and the blue. Really love these colors. Made it inside. Huh. Don't know what you're doing in our compound. But since you're here, let's see what you're made of. There we go. need that because I actually did do this one so many times I already actually know how I should move oh, wait, oh, oh that's why I didn't have any focus anymore <laughs> right I do seem to actually run out of it a lot really fast Down. Didn't mean to have that on the cooldown. God damn it. Thought that uh, that actually was already off cooldown. <sighs> right. Here we have that one. Drolny BT Oyakari. Uh. Command bonus XP. Huh. I'm actually wondering is this a, is this area actually a great place for you to farm? Because if that last one actually gives you like fifty-eight, I actually need to count for those other beasts how many command points they actually give you. Hmm. You can actually solo this flashpoint. You're not giving up, are you? You're really gonna see this through. Huh. Because I actually always used to do the chapter 3 Outlander for uh, the farming of uh, command points XP. Well, that's just for command points. I actually need to check that out later on today, probably, or next month. Done. But yeah. 
Yeah, come on. Okay, either I'm missing a lot with my twin saber throws or my accuracy. Yeah, no, it's above 100. 106. I mean, I know I'm not really carrying the best gear, but still, come on. Yeah, that one actually gives me hey, also. I was almost up to Mando huh. standards. I think I'm actually gonna be testing that out uh, in just a moment. Well, basically after I bulk recorded all these these episodes. Because if that doesn't, this is a huge exploit. <laughs> because I don't believe there is actually double XP going on right now. Nope. I mean, I think that's an exploit if you can basically just keep doing the, these ones. I mean, this one isn't really all that long. I mean, I'm not right now. I'm just taking it easy just because I actually am recording also. But anyway, thank you guys all for watching. Hope you all enjoy and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye guys.